Hey guys, this video is specifically for iPhone users and you guys might be knowing that there is no back button in the iPhone calculator application. If you are in the middle of a bigger calculation and by mistake you have entered a wrong digit, you have to erase it fully. But you can use this simple gesture by swiping right to left to make it work as a back button. As you can see, just swipe it from right to left on the empty portion and you can use that gesture as a back button. It will save you from doing the big calculation once again. Instead of learning all these gestures, Apple could have easily added a back button, isn't it? I hope this trick has helped. Just use the gesture in the empty portion of the screen from right to left and that works as a back button. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to the channel.